Hi, Rosie the Wedding Planner here from rosythewedingplanner.com and what I want to do now is just talk you through exactly how the course works for you uh, for my Ultimate Wedding Planner training course. So basically it's presented in 10 modules in all. It's nine training modules and then a bonus module. Each module is presented to you uh, with a video to start up with to introduce you to the module and talk you through it and what you're going to be learning in that module. And then each module has MP3 files. Now these are great benefit to you because you can just listen to them off the website if you want, or you can download them onto your phone or onto your iPod and listen to them into the in the car or uh, when you're going for a walk or at the gym or whatever. So they're it's really easy. You can listen to them over and over again, so it gets into your head without even having to read a word. So it's easy to follow. And then there's a is a transcript of each of the audio files usually and uh, that transcript is uh, for you to print out it's on a um, pdf so you can just print it out on your printer and it's for a reference you can write your own notes and highlight ideas and write your own ideas on it and then usually i have a cheat sheet in each module which helps you to summarize it's basically a summary of what what we just talked about or um it's condensed form of what has happened in that module and then there's worksheets uh usually and again these are for your own benefit and it's not for you to submit so they're really just for you to actually explore what we've talked about in the module and to develop your business so that you are ready to operate in the shortest space of time possible now there's this you can see this down here it's um a symbol of a little video reel here and that means it's a video so i have created um demonstration videos now these aren't demonstrations of centerpieces or flare arrangements or whatever these are about your business so in this case it's about setting up google calendars and how i use it for my business and how you can use it to the best advantage because it took me a while to actually discover this and it's a really good thing to actually use to organize your business um so yeah so i mean then there's extra bits so i say this is under extras as I say, that's uh, films or videos that I've created. There's PDFs and there's the audio files. So by just listening to the audio files or watching the videos, you can set up your own wedding planning business in no time at all. I also have this little symbol, this little green symbol here, and that's a link back to Rosie the Wedding Planner website, uh, rosythewedingplanner.com. And that's my website for, for professional wedding planners. And there's lots of free information on there, but there's also a membership area. So it's all my students and my graduates that actually get access to this. And there's loads of these how-to videos I have on the membership area only. So it gives you lots of information there. And then we have an assignment in this one. And um, there are six assignments in all through this website. So, or through the course, I should say. So um, once you have completed them, they're not essential, but if you want a certificate, you complete those and um, submit them to me. I'll, comment back on them and you get a certificate but um as i say if you don't want a certificate that's fine you don't need to actually do them you can do the course and set up your business uh within less than eight weeks if you wanted to um but you know some people take longer or want to do it at their own leisure but as i say within the six months period i'm here for you now i'll just show you just say module four um i think let's just pick on that one say so each of the modules have the the pdfs the audio files and um, the welcome video which talks you through it so um i'm just going to pause this yeah it's automatic so i'm just going to pause that first and as you can see there's um this one is about the ceremony and the day of the wedding right so um i'll just go through it a little bit that's the intro video and then we have like the day before the wedding what you as a wedding planner should be doing not as a bride but as a wedding planner the day of the wedding uh the pre-ceremony the who what where you when the where of processionals and recessionals um and there are all the different types of wedding uh ceremonies including jewish weddings catholic weddings um, symbolic ceremonies, everything. So who and what and where should be when uh, <laughs> during during the ceremony. So um, and then the your role as a wedding planner during and after the wedding ceremony. So your responsibilities. So after this, as you can see, we have the whole 
ceremony ebook kit now these are ebooks i've created and they took me a long time to create but they're basically wedding vows wedding rituals the wedding program wedding ceremony music basically these are all ebooks and they're like about 20 pages long 10 to 20 pages long most of them and these are things these are ebooks that you can print out and actually keep and use again and again and again for every client that you have to do your weddings so um they're like uh, let me just show you one this is my um wedding rituals one so basically as you can see it's a flip book and it's it basically goes through all the different rituals and basically the words the celebrant needs to use or ideas anyway and different things you can introduce to make it extra extra romantic and this is what you do as a wedding planner you, you're giving the extra oomph to a wedding and so that's what i give you all in this and you can use it again and again and i say it's free for you to use so then as i say there's usually an extras area as well so these are just things i think that would help you in your wedding business so here i have like a sample prenuptial form for catholic weddings i mean this isn't something that you're going to give to your couples right it's what the priest will give them but you need to be familiar with it so that if your couple if your client says to you oh that form that the priest gave us see yes us on it blah blah blah, blah what do you think or whatever you are actually familiar with the type of forms that are given so this is just something that actually helps you along and i say there will be loads more information constantly added on the website rosythewedingplanner.com which i'm adding to all the time i'm giving you all the juicy information that you need to actually set up your wedding business and to hit the ground running so you can take on clients with with confidence i mean look here's module seven i'll just go through this with you and it's about here's a whole pdf about organizing yourself and your business again you just read it off screen or print it out it's very easy to do and then i do an actual demo a video demo of presentations and proposals i do for clients i talk you through them and what you should include i have booking forms and the terms and conditions and payment options that i have discovered are the easiest things for the clients to fill out and deposits receipts and invoices i deal with all that sort of stuff and i also give you a sample detailed contract in word format so that you can actually edit it as much as you like or add to it as much as you like but it's actually an extremely uh, detailed one so that you don't actually have to go and figure out what you should be including in a contract yourself so it's extremely detailed it's the one that i use for when i'm doing full on uh, full wedding planning so it's something that you can do and you can just take out my business name and put in your own so it's it's really simple and easy to use and so i have uh for you then to download i have like the sample proposals i send out to couples the forms i send out to couples the booking forms the payment options what to do next um, and all the additional info I send out to couples with their booking forms that I have found that are most effective. So I've spent 10 years learning this stuff, right? So what I'm giving you is everything that I've perfected and um, and has brought me to the stage I'm at in my business, which uh, I'm very happy about. So, I mean, module eight is the fun bits and the oomph and making money. So I tell you all about the different ideas I've i've used to uh bring an extra income because i mean even if you're doing 20 or 40 weddings a year you're you know you're not gonna hit six figures just by doing weddings that amount of weddings unless you're doing celebrity and top class weddings which great if you get but most wedding planners they get 20 to 40 weddings a year they earn a thousand two thousand from each wedding sometimes more actually you know you can earn more from each wedding but as i say that's what i go into but i go into also how you can make money out of season because a lot of times you're just stuck to the summer months and around the christmas time and that's so i'm telling you how you can make money out of season as well so that your income is flowing in and you're making money from this business because it it is beautiful business to be in it's great fun to be in and you want to be making money right i mean at the end of the day you want to make an income so that you're not stressed about your bills and that you can be your own boss and have the freedom to do what you want to do and i say it's that's what's great about wedding planning is that you can actually it is quite seasonal 
you can actually say, okay, I'm going to have March off or I'm going to have April off and I'm going to travel during that time. That's what I did this year. I went off for three weeks when I had a break. I said, hey, look, I have a break in May. Let's go off to Italy and France. So we bundled off the kids and my husband in the camper van and we went off for the three weeks. And it was a great thing to actually do and uh, enjoy. But I also because I'm a workaholic, checked out places while I was there. And I visited a place that had invited me and they let me stay for free. And it was it was a great experience for us all. So as I say, that is the benefit of being your own boss and also the benefit of being a wedding planner. So what I'm showing you is I'm giving you everything that I've learned and I'm also um, showing you exactly how to get confident in being a wedding planner and giving you all the tools that I have developed or all the systems and all the formulas that I've developed over the years to actually make my business work. So if you want to know more about how to become a wedding planner and know more about my courses and would like lots of free advice about being a wedding planner, starting your own business if you don't feel ready yet to actually do a course, that's not a problem. There's lots of free information on my website and the website is rosytheweddingplanner.com. Go there now and put your name and email address in the opt-in box so that I can stay in touch with you and let you know about what it's like to be a wedding planner so you can make the decision whether it's a good option for you in your future. Good luck and I'll see you over there.